So here we are in the Texas coast where we're trying to understand how coastal ecosystems function. A uh, really big part of that is hydrology. We're here on the shores of San Antonio Bay, which connect to our coastal marshes uh, over this way at the Aransas National Wildlife Refuge. And uh, we've just wrapped up our expedition where we're trying to link that hydrology to the coastal marshes. Uh, and a really big part of that is also the whooping crane, the endangered whooping crane. Um, it's a population that's gone through a lot of change through the years, but it's currently on the rebound. About 300 uh, individuals in this, the last natural migratory population in the world. Um, we've spent the last week on the marsh with the birds, observing them, trying to figure out how their behavior and their behavioral patterns shift at different coastal sites. Um, we've done surveys of the hydrology, we've done surveys of food resources like the blue crabs and the, uh, the Carolina wolfberry. And um, all in all, we're trying to take a holistic and ecosystem approach to understanding how this entire system functions. Uh, the whooping cranes sort, sort of perched at the top of that system, but uh, we, we enter at the bottom from a hydrology point of view. We try to understand food resources. We try to understand how um, greater hydrological processes in the watershed uh, all work to impact um, that one species.